It's Burrito Bison time. Hello everybody, what's going on? Jerome here, and I have you guys some Burrito Bison Revenge gameplay, and we are back in action with it. Also, I just want to thank you guys. Last time I asked you guys to try and get it a thousand likes, and you guys were awesome about it, and it's actually been really well, so thank you guys for the support. I want to thank you all for that, and as always, 20 minute face cam, GG. Alright, so let's get going with this thing. I actually just finished up a calc test, which you'd think I'd be dying and crying on the floor right now, which I am inside. My soul is defeated. But I'm just kidding around, though. Actually, though that's the thing the crazy part about commentating is for some reason or whatever reason it is you get really happy when you start to commentate and it's just like you just feel good i don't know how to explain it but basically the support you guys give really picks me up at least probably to pick other commentators up as well it's kind of picks up the mood in general and uh, i'm happy to say oh look at neon burrito that's a neon burrito oh my god i love the neon burrito earn 1800 dollars in one launch oh baby so we just got ourselves another challenge we're too good too tough. Can't stop me. I also gotta get some of those corrupted cops. I hear that they're really good, so I'm gonna try and invest in one of them. Well, I jump around a lot while I talk, don't I? Banana pickles. Okay, so let's keep going. Oh, and the, uh, look at that. We're not gonna stop now. Come on, let's go for the, the new record. We're going for $3,000. Let go. Oh, this is it. This is it. Our $3,000 run. Oh, look how beautiful that is. Even if we don't make it that much further, it's it's okay. We managed to get $3,000 in one run. Oh! Oh, but, oh, we got stopped by that cop. Wait, that was good, though. That was not bad. And we got the plus 500 there. Squash a total of five gummies carrying items. That doesn't even say in one round. That's that's easy. What, what's Why is that even a thing? Like, that's not hard at all. This this game's getting a little too easy. They're getting flaccid on us, I think. I, I think this game is getting a little flaccid. I'm not gonna lie here. I think I think this is gonna be a problem. We gotta get it we gotta get it a little bit more uh a little bit more firm if you catch my drift. This game is going easy on us. Oh god, come on. Come on, keep wow we're we are owning. Jeez, we're getting not that we're owning, we're kinda just getting lucky. But it's same same thing. Same thing in most flesh player games, I gotta say, so you know, can't really complain. All right, here we go. Come on, keep going. Oh, we got this one. We got this one to the house. What am I even... What's my... Oh, that's right. I have to squash five special gummies. That was it. Was, no, it wasn't special. It was gummies with items. I was trying to remember that. I was like, hmm, what was it? And I got it. I finally got it. Oh, yeah. Oh, by the way, guys, I've realized something. Today on the bus, never try and show off to anyone. <laughs> so I'm riding the bus home from uh, from school today, and this one kid, I swear to you, I'm not, I'm not kidding at all, tries impressing, I don't know if he's impressing the girl next to him or trying to impress some other people around him, but he decided it'd be best to stand up on the bus and not hold on to anything. Mind you, it is snowing like crazy outside the window right now. Obviously, it's a horrible, horrible idea. But he decides, no, you know what, this is the day that I need to try and crack my skull open. So he goes, tries riding the, like, the bus, like literally going surfing, and completely falls flat on his face. So the PSA and the support message of the day is don't try and impress anyone while surfing on a bus. It doesn't work in the first place, I guarantee it. You could ask any girl, it's not impressive at all and you're gonna fall flat on your face and die. So that is the moral of the story message of the day from Jerome. Don't do it. Just don't do it, okay? Oh, look at that explosion. Come on. Oh, we keep getting a propeller hatch, but look, the worst one. Give me something good. I want, I want to get like, the aviator. I love getting the aviator guy. Also, if you're wondering, it is cold out. That is why I'm wearing this jacket right now. This is actually a really heavy jacket. Look, this thing, I think this thing could take a bullet or two. I wouldn't be surprised if I got shot and just like deflected off this jacket. It's got, it's like a four or five pound jacket. But I love this thing. It keeps you warm and toasty as anything. And I can't believe I just missed a Neon burrito. How do you miss the, oh, chubby! I love getting the chubby gummies. Oh, no, no, don't, don't fail me now. Feet don't fail me now. Oh, we're going, we're going. Oh, there it is. Boom, shaka, look at that. That was good. Oh my god, look at that. From a chubby gummy all the way to a propeller hat. Look at that one thing. Not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, there it is. I figured that'd be the fifth gummy for the item thing, so at least we got that. Let's see, what's our new challenge? Here it comes. Cover a distance of 1,000 meters without hurting yourself on the ground during the same launch. Wow, okay, now we're talking. That's actually a really... That's a really difficult one to get unless you have, like, say, Rocket Slam or something along those lines. Yeah, that, that is a very difficult one to get. And, oh, man, Rocket Slam apparently, too. If you hit the ground with Rocket Slam, that doesn't count. You have to nail them on the head. Oh, wait, never mind. Rocket Slam actually does protect you. Still, though, that's that's a little crazy. I, 
I don't think I think that should come a little bit later in the game to be honest. I don't think I don't think we should be dealing with that challenge just yet. Maybe a little bit. Oh come on. Oh really? Really? Also guys, I'm really sad. Sunday night I was watching The Walking Dead and then I ended up falling asleep before I could finish it. And I was like, you know what? I gotta watch it on Monday. And if you don't know already, Walking Dead is my favorite show. So I wake up Monday and then I'm like, wait a minute. I have to study for a big calc test today. So I didn't get to finish watching. Literally 15 minutes left in the episode, and I am right at this crate. Like, imagine this. You're at, like, your favorite show. You're at, like, the best part of the episode, and then you can't watch it until now. And as soon as I'm with the calc test, though, I have a chem test tomorrow. So I don't even know if I'm going to be able to watch it today. And I, mean, I just keep crying inside. Like, part of me keeps dying every moment that I don't watch that show. And I just, I want to watch it. I love The Walking Dead. I'm honestly like the biggest Walking Dead crony fan you will ever meet. So that's that's just something a little bit extra about me. And Breaking Bad. The two of those shows combined, oh my god, I can't even imagine. About a, a guy who cooks meth in the zombie apocalypse world. I would, I, I would love that. Actually, why, they should do that one day. Breaking Bad meets Walking Dead. It'd probably be the worst show and collaboration in the history of this planet. But I'd watch it. I don't know about you guys. I'd sure as hell watch that. I, 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 I don't know. I, I come up with some pretty bad ideas in the mornings. So don't never ask me for an idea in the morning or extremely late at night. Because generally some of the worst ideas in this planet, and mostly on ASF, come from me. So just throwing that out there. If you see any bad ideas on ASF, usually my fault. Alright, so what do we got here? Now, I think someone was saying I should get the... What is he called? Wait, let's see what these guys do. Time talk will make the launching meter shout slower and easier to hit. Unlock by performing a perfect launch against the Berserker. Oh, so you have to do different things. To get, I was going to say, so I can't just buy them. All right, well, there was one other thing that someone was suggesting I get. They said, like, the uh, Corrupted Cops, was it? Cruisers. Have a chance of encountering cruisers. I guess that's the Corrupted. That My guess is that is what a Corrupted Cop is. But the thing is, $15,000 is a, kind of a lot of money. I don't really... I don't know, I'm not feeling that. That is that is definitely a little bit too much for me. Oh, but a rocket rider is only ten grand. Let's go with that. You know what? Maybe, maybe I'll try and max those out to at least level one by the end of this. That's gonna be my goal. By the end of this episode, I will have level one of all the chubby gummies, and I will start to move on to getting level three for all the others. <gasps> Nyan burrito! Oh my god, we got five hundred six hundred meters now. Oh, and we had we it was mandatory we hit the ground because of that door. So we just we hit the Nyan burrito, we had like six hundred meters going. And we had no choice but to botch it. That's really sad. That's depressing because we were doing so good. Rocket. Oh, we got it on the first try. There we go. Click and hold to gain speed or at least at the right moment to explode. Okay. So we're riding it then. And oh, I missed it by like an inch. Oh, well. Oh, man. Actually, if I had not. Oh, well. If I had flawless that, I think we would have gotten a candy landed. That would have been. That would have been crayfish. I think we're getting really close to doing it. So, geez, I, I can't keep screwing up like that. That was a little. That was a little bit terrible that I, I had screwed up so late in the game. I only See, when you screw up that late and that close to it, you just kind of wish inside that you had screwed up earlier so you don't have to you don't have to feel that like pressure of being like, yes, I got it, and then you don't, and then you feel like crap about it, and then everyone's all sad, and then and then you cry yourself to sleep, and I, okay, maybe this is something that's only happened to me. I don't know. Probably. And sweet mother of God, I don't know if you guys can hear that. There's a car out there. It is screeching like crazy. He's got to fix those brakes up or whatever's wrong with that car. There is there's something funky going on there. What's this? Hey, eight grand. Not bad at all. Oh, flawless. I love that. Oh, my God. How did I get $850 off the start of the game? I didn't even... All I did was flawless and hit like a... I, I, I don't even... I guess maybe they have like flying people that hold money now in Burrito Bison Revenge. I don't really... I don't know. I don't even. I don't even know what to say. I have no clue what just happened. But whatever did, that is crazy. Like that should not be a thing. Oh baby, two thousand dollars. Keep it going. Keep it going. Come on. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna hit this. We're gonna hit this. Oh, look at that explosion. That feeling when you hit that explosion and blow every other gummy up in sight. It's a good feeling. Hashtag that feel. No, I'm just kidding. I stole that from Christian. I'm sorry, Christian. Don't hurt me. Uh, Mr. CEO, where would we be without him? Okay, here we go. Flawless. Oh, I thought I'd pull off another flawless. That'd be awesome. I can't imagine what Fortune 7 does in this game. Honestly, the amount of money you must get is just incredible. Like, I, I can't even imagine. The problem is, it's $31,000 before you can upgrade that again. So I don't really know if I'm in the mood to necessarily upgrade that anytime soon, because that is like 20 minutes worth of gameplay. So I have to make sure it's worth it. Oh god, here we go, here we go. Ah, oh, too late again, and we miss an aviator gummy by an inch too. Squad, oh god, 
Here we go, here we go. Did, oh my god, I missed it again! You've gotta be kidding me right now. So close, twice in a row. Oh baby! We made it to can- There's no achievement for going to Candyland? Why is there no achievement for that? I just fucking broke through the wall to Candyland. And I don't get anything? Really? This game. This game. What are we going to do with it? Oh, wait. New mission. Break the sweet desert's giant door in less than 23 seconds. That is probably the craziest challenge that this game could offer. How are you supposed to do that in 23 seconds? I could barely do it, period, let alone in 23 seconds. Maybe if I hit, maybe if I hit five Nyan Cat thingies, maybe it would be possible. Oh, we hit the explosion just right. And holy crap. Oh, my God. Because we broke the door at the wrong time... We only got 700 meters as opposed to 1,000 meters. How much does that suck? Holy crap, holy crap. This could be it. Oh my god, oh my god, come on. No, again! Again we hit it because we had 900 meters. But because we hit the door, it ruined us twice in a row. Oh my god, that is that is not fair. Oh god, poor game. Why is that even a thing? That's actually awful. Like, I I'm actually really sad about this. Well, at least we got the cruisers, who I think are the corrupt cops. So at least we got them on our side now. So let's see how well, if we can grab one of those, I want to see how well they, like, how well they do? How, go how good they do, because from what I hear, they're the best. Oh, we flawless that one, too. And, of course, we hit the ground when we're on a roll. Every time we end up breaking through a door, and it's just like, oh, sorry, you have to lose the thing that you're on because the game wants to make you as angry as possible before uh, you go any further. Oh, come on, do we have enough speed to break through this door this time? Holy God, Cruiser, Cliff's badge, you can increase the size of the explosion. Holy crap! Oh, we didn't get the challenge, though. Never mind, so a cruiser's not a corrupt cop. How do I get a corrupt cop, then? Maybe that was one of the main stats you have to... I, th I think, you know what? It might be the stat that says you lose that speed against when you hit a cop. I think that other one also encompasses the chance of hitting corrupt cops. So we're going to look out for that one. Oh, come on. We're doing so good. Come on. We can do this. We can do Oh, well, that was quite embarrassing. That was definitely not that good of a run. Okay, well, actually, no, we, we got a good amount of money. So let's, let's go shopping now. Let's go. So, bam. Level 1 to all those guys. How much money does it cost to get? $25,000 to get a cyborg jawbreaker? Uh, no, thank you. Oh, bye, dude. Here we go. Lose less control and increase the chance of finding corrupt cops. There we go. So, I guess that was that was all that was needed then. And, jeez, we're on our way to getting all those level 3. We might be able to get... Uh, I mean, my goal was just to start getting those level 3 by the end of the episode. And I think there's a chance we might end up getting all them level 3 by the end. So I think I think we might beat our goal out for this, which would be pretty crazy. We're we're already done with our one goal. But I think we might be able to accomplish two in one day. Oh, come on, Cruiser. Oh, that's right. You gotta tap it as quick as possible to make the explosion big. Look at that. Oh, my God, no. Screw you. I swear to God, if I screw this up, no. I'm not screwing up now. Come on. So close. Oh my god, like 950 of them too. I was at like 950 meters. I couldn't have... Oh, I couldn't have been closer even if I tried. Oh man, that is awful. That is, that's, that's insane. 950 meters of a thousand. And the game decides to screw up then. Oh man. Oh well, what are you going to do? You win some, you lose some. And that guy was not a corrupt cop. That makes me sad. Although I do like one thing. I like that they don't arrest you. You pretty much tackle and arrest the cops. I think I think that's a pretty cool addition to the game. Here we go, though. Elastic cables. Let's see. Cause I, I want to get the elastic cable because part of me says that, you know, the best thing in the world is getting a good start. So I have a feeling if we get that good start, there's a chance we might be able to break through those desert doors in the amount of time needed to get that achievement. So that is why, if you're wondering, I invested in that. Even though, you know, generally speaking, it's probably not like the best thing in the world. It's definitely good for, for keeping you going and picking you up. Let's get you rolling is the, is the main thing. Okay, come on. No. I think I only had 24 seconds to break through this door. Maybe it was like 30. I have to check what the challenge was again because I can't remember. Because if it was 24 seconds, that is just not right. That is immoral. I can't lie. It's Mr. Cruiser. No, please. Por que, Mr. Cruiser? Okay, let's see. Let's see. In 23 seconds, the day... The day that that happens, I will be amazed. And there we go. Police control. Let's hope we hit a corrupt cop. I wonder if once you get level 7, if like, all the cops are corrupt. That would be crazy. Because honestly, then the game would be so much easier. I, be I bet you most of them actually end up being corrupt in the end. Oh my god! We hit the burrito into a neon bison! No way! 
And I kind of wonder, why do you name, why is this game Burrito Bison? Like, honestly, I know I made the joke last time, but the creator of this game had to have, had to have been high when they made it. There's no way in the world this is the production of a completely, completely non, you know, little bit, uh, crazed up mind. This is no way, because how in the world do you think of something like this? Hold on, here we go. Pilot a plane. Oh my god. So there's a there's a challenge for literally doing what I do all the time, for just getting an aviator. Literally, all I have to do is touch the aviator and I get a challenge. I'm fine with that. That's an easy challenge. This game, though, too many challenges, honestly. Oh, God. Big Oh, look at the size of that explosion. That was a good... That was a really good one. I, I maxed that one out. Sorry for the, the mad pounding as well. I can't control... Oh, my God, Corrupt Cup. Corrupt Cups don't stop you, but give you an extra rocket slam? That's all they do? Well, that's really boring. I thought they would, like, send you forward at, like, a s severely high speed or give you, like, a rocket or something. Just give me an extra rocket slam. It's pretty, pretty boring. They they should, they could have done a little bit more with that. I think the, the corrupt cops should give you a little bit more than just one little rocket slam. Oh, I get it. So the green ones are the corrupt cops, I'm pretty sure. And the ones that have the red are the... So that guy probably was a corrupt cop. Okay, that's cool. I think it's a little testy, though, getting close to cops to see which one they are, but... That's okay. You know what? Let's see. What can we up? Let's get an increased speedometer so we can get an increased fastest rate possible. I'm curious to see how fast we can go. I bet you. I bet you we end up actually putting that to the test. Oh my god. Man, bison. Here we go. How have I not run into a single aviator since I got that challenge? Come on. Come on. Keep it up. Keep it up. Oh, propeller at. No, no, no. There we go. It's getting a little worried there. It's got oh, we missed the rocket. Holy Jesus. Holy Jesus, we're moving a little quick. Oh my god! We did that in 24 seconds. We almost actually got that challenge. I can't believe it. How in the world does that even... I, I didn't think it was that possible, but apparently it's, it's a thing. I had no clue. Oh my god, and we have $5,000 to spare just from one run? I'll take it. Jesus. So let's see, what can we buy now? We can pay for another corrupt cop or bodybuilding. Need less speed to break through giant doors and lose less speed afterward. Okay, we'll get that. And what else can we get? Ah, we're coming close to getting level 3 on everything in one level. Oh, look at that. No, look at $951. I think it's because I hit him so hard that I fly into the sky. And I think whenever you fly into the sky, this game gives you like an extra $1,000. The only thing I can think of, because I always seem to get like a thousand extra dollars. Not always. Sometimes I get a thousand extra dollars when I'm playing. And it's confusing as anything because I have no clue why. Oh, God. Yes, that's a problem with the corrupt cops. You can't see them until it's too late. I, I think I'm just gonna watch out for it. Oh, apparently we piloted a plane. Okay, cool. We got the challenge, and I'll take it. I'll take it. And there we go. Let's see what the new challenge is. Come on, give me something good. Give me something good. Squash three gummies carrying items during the same launch. Well, that's not too bad. That's not too bad at all, actually. Let's see. We get elastic cables. For a more powerful, yeah, we'll, we'll do that. That way we can hit the sky more often. And I think, yeah, we're, we're going to do like two, three more runs of this probably by the end. Let's see, look, how, how, how far can we, oh, we're missing. <gasps> Man, Bison, I knew there was a reason that we missed that aviator. I knew there had to have been a, a special purpose to all of this. And oh my god, we can do this, we can do this, come on. Come on, hit that door 23 seconds flat. Oh, if I had hit that police cruiser, this would have been so much easier. Oh my god, we missed it by 1.8 seconds. What are the chances of that? That is awful. That feeling when it just screws you up like that. And holy crap, we're going to beat our record on this run. This run, that I was going to say, that was a good, that was a really good run. I, I'm proud of myself. That was some really good stuff there. And oh, we had a cop. No, unless we, unless we somehow magically keep going. Oh, I've got to squash that cop. Come on, grab the money. At least grab that money. Oh, there we go. We got a challenge, too. Wow, so look at that. Doing that, going the extra mile can sometimes help. Who would have thought? Perform a total of four perfect launches. Well, that's pretty much a joke of a challenge. What, what, what is even the point of that? That's too easy. Give me something harder. All right, and we could get police control. I could save up for, I'm going to save up for bounciness. I'm going to do two more runs of this. Oh, there we go. There's one of them, so only three more of those, and we are pretty much GG on this whole thing. Oh, God. Oh my god, the speed. The speed. Oh, it blew up the rocket before we got to the end, so we didn't get the full use of it. That is disappointing. Oh, we gotta keep using our rocket. Oh, we gotta get lucky here. We're gonna break the. We broke it in less than 23 seconds. I have no clue how that is even a thing. 
but we did it. I'll take it. I'll take the challenge, honestly. Believe me, I will gladly take the challenge. That is crazy good. Oh, God. So we'll, we're doing one more run. We're about to stop here. So one more run after this, and then we'll call it quit. Oh, wait a minute. I stand corrected. We're still in this. Holy crap. I was ready to give up that run, but we are still going strong. Well, semi-strong. Oh, never mind. Sorry, dudes. Okay. So we have one more run. What do we got here? Squash a total of 300 gummies. All right, so not bad challenges overall. Those challenges aren't too bad. There we go, bounciness, and only leaves three more things left to get level three of everything. Here we go, I'm going to nose cam this one. Nose cam for the final. Oh, we missed. No, please. I know, the nose cam stares deep into people's soul. There are no survivors when I do this. <laughs> Trust me. I'm just kidding around. I won't make you guys suffer for that long. Or will I? I'm just kidding. I won't because then I can't see the screen. Otherwise, though, expect it. Expect the nose cam. It's a dangerous thing. Oh, God. Every time we get this rocket, I feel... Oh, we managed to blow it up right before the door. So we got the full usage out of it. I was just about to say, every time we get it, I feel like we never really get the full usage of it. Oh, come on. Keep going, keep going. Holy crap. We are going to demolish this record here. We might actually make it to the next door. We're not going to break the door. But there's a chance that we'll make it to the next door. A very slim one. Oh my god. Never mind. Scratch what I was just saying with a slim chance. We are definitely going to hit the next door. It's a matter of breaking it at this point. Come on. Holy crap, we broke it. We just broke through two different layers of door that we had never broken through before. In the same game. It's because we did the nose cam. Mother of god. Well, guys, on that note, thank you all for watching, and the nose cam is good luck. Good night, everybody.